Shopping Tips for Double Security Doors Before you buy your new double security doors, you should know what sizes you're looking for. While you might have double doors or even double security doors already installed, you can't necessarily rely on those measurements. As in many things, it's best to start fresh. First, measure the width. Measure from one side of the door opening to the other. You will measure across the top, middle, and bottom. Write down the smallest measurement. Then, measure the height. Measure from the trim to the threshold on the left side, the right side, and the center. Again, use the smallest measurement. Then, note how your exterior door is hinged. You will most likely need to buy a security door with the hinges on the same side as your exterior door. It's natural to want the best security door possible for your home. However, if you live in an area with low crime, then you probably don't need the same security as a casino at Las Vegas. If you're not sure what would be best for your home, then there are easy ways to find out. Your neighbors, for example, might have recommendations. Your community might also have resources. Your local police or fire department, for instance, may offer free security inspections. Even if they don't regularly offer inspections, they might agree to perform one if you ask. They would, after all, have the best perspective on what crimes are most common in your area. Finally, you can also check with your insurance company for their recommendations. Sometimes they even offer discounts for upgraded security. Once you've got your doors picked out and installed, that's not the end of your work. You should perform regular maintenance checks on your security doors to make sure they're keeping you safe. After all, they are your first line of defense. At least once a month, clean the doors as recommended by the manufacturer. If the manufacturer has no specifications, mild soap and standard glass cleaner, if necessary, should be fine. When you clean the doors, take the time to inspect them for damage or mechanical issues. Repairing small problems now can save you from having to deal with larger problems later. Keep the hinges and the closer, if applicable, oiled or lubricated as recommended. Check the lock hardware to make sure it's working like it should. This video brought to you by Doors.com.